तुलसी सिद्धांत सरस्वती विजयते गौरीय गोष्ठीपति वंदे गुरुपद्वंद भक्तबिंद श्रीचैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंद सहोदित श्रीनंदनंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सयुक्त बिंदनमोहर वाशा कल्पतरु वैश्य कृपा सिंधु व्यवच पति पावने वैष्णवेभ्यो नमो नम मुकोति वाचा लंग पंगु लंघयति गिरी यत्तमहंग वंदे परमाधव बृंदा वै तुलसीदेव वै पिया वै केशव स्नभक्ति प्रतिदेवी सत्वत्व नमो नम नारायण नमस्कृत नरुंच नरोत्तम देवी सरस्वती व्यास तथो जयो मुदीर संकीर्तने कृष्ण कथोपदेश गौरीय पत्र प्रकाशने सदानुरक्त गुरु भक्ति युक्त भक्ति प्रमोदाक्ष जगोदरुण धेय सदा परिभवन भविष्य दोहम तेथास्पद शिव विरचनुत शरण्यम वेत्तातिहम पुनोपाल भवादीपोत वंदे महापुरुष ते चरुणरविंद यत्दपल्लवनखचंदमनीछटा विस्फुजीत किमी गोधुष्वदर्शि पूर्णागरसागर सारूर्ति साराधि कामयि कदा कि श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनीतानंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद श्रीकृष्ण चैतन्य प्रभुनीतानंद श्री अद्वैत गदाधर शिव सदी गौरभक्तबिंद हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे आजानुलम्बित भुज कनुका बुदा तो संकीर्तन कपितर कमलायताक्ष भीषाबरो दिजवरो जुगधर्म पालो वंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुणा भारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे नमा गंगे तव पाद पंकज सुरासुरवंदी तो दिव्य रूप भुक्ति मुक्ति दी नीतम भावान्ण सदा नरान गंगा तरंगरमणीय जटा कलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषित बाम भाग नारायणो प्रिय मनंगो मदापहारम वाराणसी पुरापति भज विश्वनाथ बागीशजुस्व वदने लक्ष्मीजस् चक्षसी यस्ते हृदय संबी सिंह भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे 
शबक्तिवसुध्याम निज भजन मुद्राम उपदिशन श्री चैतन्य किंगमे पुनरपी दीश्वर यस्वातिपदम शबक्तिवसुध्याम निज भजन मुद्राम उपदिशन स चैतन्य किंगमे पुनरपी दीश्वर यस्वातिपदम गौरी गोष्ठीपति गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी प्रभुपा परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट टू गेट एस्टाब्लिश इन द आचार आदर्श आचरण ऑफ गौरांग महाप्रभु इट मीन्स प्रचारक इट मीन्स ही कैन गो फॉर टीचिंग गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी प्रभुपा परमंश जगदगुरु सेट दैट to get established in the achar adarsha acharan shiksha of sri chaitanya mahaprabhu it's the actual meaning of a of preaching then he can preach otherwise nobody can preach simon mahaprabhu in nilachal leela always and every time wanted to each of his action each and every of his action निज भजन मुद्राम उपदेशन ही वॉन्टेड टू टीच अस वेरी केयरफुली ऑल द टाइम एक्चुअली विदाउट आचरण प्रचार इज नॉट पॉसिबल एंड पर्सनल भजन तो ऑल्सो नॉट पॉसिबल इफ देर इज नो आचरण देन नो क्वेश्चन ऑफ एनी प्रीचिंग वाट टू स्पीक अबाउट प्रीचिंग ऑल्सो इट इज नॉट पॉसिबल फॉर मी टू डू भजन इट इज नॉट पॉसिबल दिस वे नॉट पॉसिबल गौरकिशोर दास बाबाजी महाराज जगन्नाथ दास बाबाजी महाराज ऑल एवरीबॉडी दे आर एस्टेब्लिश इन द आचरण ऑफ चैतन्य महाप्रभु दैट्स वाई विदाउट गोइंग टू एनी फॉरेन कंट्री दे आर प्रीचिंग ऑल ओवर द वर्ल्ड रूप सनातन आई एम नॉट स्पीकिंग नो बॉडी शुड गो आई एम नॉट स्पीकिंग दैट वे आई एम स्पीकिंग दैट भक्ति ठाकुर और ऑल आवर गुरु वर्ग मोस्ट ऑफ देन दे आर आचरण सो इफेक्टिव दैट maybe after some time now bhakti vinod thakur is writing his acharan gaur kishor baba his acharan everything and bhakti siddhant saraswati goswami to prabhupad his acharan all ex exclusive acharan they are established that's why it is possible to for them to change the heart of bonded soul bhakti vinod thakur wrote in article that if you go on speaking so much philosophy preaching doesn't mean i can memorize some dry philosophy and speak in front of you preaching doesn't mean i can memorize some philosophy and speak in front of you not that bhakti mundo was speaking if you go on speaking different philosophy new new philosophy but still you cannot change the heart of anybody if you are established in nam bhajan all the acharan of chaitanya mahaprabhu everything specially we will have to speak some glorification of hari naam you will have to speak very special some hari naam if they can if they can develop faith in hari naam if they can develop faith in guru vishnu then and only then they can, you can change their heart otherwise not possible only by fi speaking philosophy you cannot change that's why many shlokas here and there we find in bai puran also achi noti jo swasthvartham achare swayam acharati jasmad acharyo steno kirtita achi noti swasthvartham achare ये आचरण ही इज एक्चुअली ही इज गोइंग टू अप्लाई इन हिज ओन लाइफ ऑल आचरम और चैतन्य महापुर इन प्रैक्टिकल फील्ड दैट्स वाई इट इज पॉसिबल फॉर देम टू प्रीच इफेक्टिवली वेरी पावरफुल विथ आचरण दैट स्पीच इज सो पावरफुल इट कैन गिव हैज ए बिग इम्पैक्ट इन साइड हार्ट बिग एनी वे only only preaching without acharan jagannasayo tadbhavet it is written 
who is speaking only and not no other that that he is speaking i mean all can destroy the whole world destroy the whole world many time popad used to say many time popad used to say many time popad used to say dharma dhoji ganer dharma acharan बद्ध दीप के आो अधिकतर अधिकतर बद्ध दशाई लिया बेंगल बेंगल पपा दि टू से दोज हू आर होल्डिंग द फ्लैग अफ धर्म दोज हू आर ओनलि होल्डिंग द फ्लैग अफ धर्म धर्म ध्वजीगण दे हाव नो आचरण दोज हू आर होल्डिंग द फ्लैग अफ धर्म एंड प्रिचर धर्म दे आर आचरण व्हाट दे आर डुईंग that acharan can bring all bonded soul those who are hearing attend him to more and more down more and more down mane at least at present what was at present in what state he is he can go down so prabhupada used to say those who are holding the flag of dharma they are they are acharan acharan mean whatever they acharan they are swaying false acharan that acharan can bring that acharan can bring down all bonded souls those who are attending him to more and more poor condition than they were before maybe before this uh, before it was okay so jagan nasayo tad bhavet for it is for the destruction of the world this kind of preaching can cause the destruction of the world रूप सनातन रघुनाथ भट्ट ऑल रघुनाथ गोसाई ऑल एवरीबॉडी दे आर हैविंग आचरण नाउ क्वेश्चन इज दैट व्हाट डू यू मीन बाय आचरण समबॉडी कैन पुट क्वेश्चन व्हाट डू व्हाट इज द इनर मीनिंग ऑफ आचरण टेकिंग बाथ फाइव टाइम और डूइंग आचमन और चेंजिंग क्लोथ टाइम टू टाइम दिस इज आचरण हु नोज somebody can play some drama showing that i am pure watch washing clothes everything three time taking bath going to imitate like mahaprabhu but is using bhagavatam brahmachari should take this is acharan actually inner meaning of acharan is that serving mood inner meaning of acharan is and all other thing related to the automatically inner meaning of acharan mean your serving temperament how much you are how much you are busy to serve bhagwan all the time without any gap that is called acharan be it in the form of hari naam but you cannot do it that jagannath das baba ji maharaj can do hari das sagur can do our bangshi das baba ji maharaj can gaur kishor baba ji maharaj can popat can do very difficult even one characterless people even one characterless people he can become great vishnu great vishnu by the mercy by the keeper of shuddha vishnu whereas very pure character you are showing to a, you are going to ex exhibit your character is very good your character your uh, you know everything you have your punctuality you maintain character everything punctuality everything you have your idealism all can go to water all can go to water simply without serving temperament all you has no got no value material people they can have so much idealism so much truthfulness so much punctuality they have to prove but those have got no meaning zero useless so one brahmachari one sanyasi one baba can try to prove that we are very poor we are trying so and so but this is not the your stick this is not a your stick on the basis even our kesab gosi maharaj used to take bath one time in a in a month 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 in a month one or two time no time but strange 
No bad smell coming from his body. Miracle. He used to take bath one time or two times in whole month. No time. Always writing, giving instruction. But still no bad smell coming from body. Or prakita sarir. Strange. Because they have serving temperament. All the time giving answer to different people. Those who are, you know, so-called sahajyadi. So great. All the time busy. In writing, speaking, arranging, everything. This is called acharan. Acharan doesn't mean that you have a punctuality, this, that. Maybe you have a, such nice, nice qualities, but no devotional mood. You have no love unto the lotus feet of Guru Padma. Guru Padma, Bhaktoik Esham Guru Deva Tatma. This word Prabhupada used to say very important. Guru Deva Tatma. Bhaktoik Esham Guru Deva Tatma. He is now in such a position that Guru Dev and disciple, Mane disciple and Guru Dev, that almost Guru Dev and disciple all same. And I mean the heart of disciple is Guru Dev sitting all the time. All the time. Guru Dev is sitting. So he is get, getting divine instruction all the time. Our Guru Bhargo, Prabhupada is here in Bharat. Prabhupada is here in Bharat, na? Our Guru Bhagavan Goswami Maharaj, our Goswami Maharaj, outside country. Automatically, how they are getting, getting inspiration, what to do, what to speak today? Automatically. Automatically they are paper. So it is 100% possible. It is 100% possible. This kind of power is there in Sadguru. It is 100% possible. Maybe you cannot believe, but it's possible. You can try yourself with Sadguru. Suppose your Gurudev is Sadguru. My Gurudev gone. I am a street beggar. I will say, who helped me? Bhagavan helped me. Somehow, Bhagavan catch my ear and bring, do this seva, do this seva, automatically. Who engaged me in publication? Automatically. That was the blessings of Guru Maharaj. So, all power coming from Gurudev. All power, everything coming from Gurudev. Everything coming. So, you can see, Baba speaking, that serving mood is more important. Serving mood. Your maintaining of external purity is not so important. Even if you have nothing, but you have love and respect, tremendous love unto the Gurudev, then you can come out successful. Rup Sanatan, all, all our Sargosami, they are, they are actually eternal parsat. They are actually eternal parsat of Mahaprabhu. Eternal parsat all. But still, they are following like human being, ordinary human. They are following Ekadoshi. They are following Ekadoshi. They are following Ekadoshi. They are joining Janmashtami, Radhashtami, all. All, everything in total. They are Paramahansa, topmost Paramahansa. They are following all rules and regulations. Nam, Sankirtan, writing, everything, all rules and everything they are following. But they need not follow. They are eternal person. But still for our teachings. In Nilachal, now we can start, we can see each and every word, each and every action of Sriman Mahaprabhu has some deep meaning. Inner meaning, deep inner meaning. He wanted to teach us. Each and every action has some meaning, deep meaning. So, Rup Sanatan, they physically staying in Vrindavan and all following all rules and regulations. Etiquette, everything. Even at that time, Rup Sanatan, Vishwa Vaishnava Rasava. At that time, any, any so called Gauriya making any mistake. They used to call him and rectify. Why you are making this? 
That was the situation. At present, if you make some wrong, rubbish activities, some society can call you, join us. I can, we can give you facility. Yes, like political game. Practically, I am speaking. Gurudev going to throw that disciple. Go, go away from me. And another temple will, you come to us. No problem, come to us. This is the situation at least. But previously, that was situation is totally separate. Whole Vindavan, whole Vindavan was under the, almost under the control, I mean the, under the guidance of Rupa Sanadha. They cannot do anything rubbish. They are bound to follow strict rules and regulations. And after that, they go on Rupa Sanatana, their Jiva Goswami has become Rasabha, Vespato. So, they are going to follow in total everything, all the acharan of Masivan Mahaprabhu. Discussing about Mahaprabhu and reading Bhagavatam all the time, writing. But if somebody starts argument, Simati Radharani doing Akadoshi or not? If somebody is putting question, is Simati Radharani doing Akadoshi or not? No? Then why we should follow? Radharani is not doing Akadoshi. And why should he? He is Acharya. If Rupa Manjari is not following Akadoshi, why should he follow Akadoshi? Somebody can say. Sonatan Goswami is not following Akadoshi or Janma. Why we can follow? Vishwanath Chukudu is giving answer. Point is that in eternal sarup, they are there in Krishna Lila. There they need not follow this. They are there in eternal sarup, there. And it is also eternal sarup. Gauranga Mahapu and all their parswat, it is also their eternal sarup. The greatest advantage, the greatest advantage in Gauriya Bhajan is that. The greatest advantage in Gauriya Bhajan is that if somebody is sincerely doing Gauriya Bhajan under the guise of Gauranga Mahapu, I mean under the guise of Prabhupada and Bhakti, if he is coming out successful, then at the time of living body, he can get, get space here in Gaurlila or also in Krishna Lila. That is the topmost example, a topmost facility. Those who are doing Gauriya Bhajan, they are going to get double benefit. If they are going to come out successful, successful means under the guidance of Gauranga, surely. Otherwise, how? Why? Well, Gauriya Bhajan is without the. Uh, so, they can get double benefit. They can enter into Gaurlila, eternal Gaurlila. At the same time, they can get entry into Krishna Lila. Suppose they are, they are actually Sadhan Siddha. I am not speaking about eternal Siddha. Those who are eternally, Bhakti Thakur, Prabhupada, they eternally they are Siddha. Those who are Sadhan Siddha, they can get facility. Because Bhakti Thakur or Prabhupada, they already there. In Gaur Lila, in Gaur Lila, the Sarup of Bhakti Thakur is Bhakti Thakur. In Gaur Lila, the Sarup of Bhakti Thakur. Uh, yes, in Gaur Lila, the Sarup. But you can start argument, how Maharaj can believe? Bhakti Thakur took birth after 300 years back. You can speak like this. North Thakur took birth after when Gauranga Mahapu... Uh, Gauranga Mahapu took birth, actually he couldn't see directly. Directly could not see. So this way, big problem. You can face big problem. Bhakti Mani Thakur, in his eternal sarup as a Gaur Parshat, Gaur Parshat is. Bhakti Mani Thakur itself, sarup. And as Kamal Manjari, he is eternally present in Krishna Lila. Both. Both all our Guru Varga. Who not? Not I am speaking about Rupa Goswami, Sonatan, not that. Everybody. Everybody. Sonatan, Rupa, eh? Every, all. They have Loknath Goswami, our North Mudhaku, Sinivas Acharya, eh? uh, Samananda Prabhu, all they have. Double. One Sarup, they are serving Radha Govindaji, and another Sarup, they are serving Gauranga. So the question can come. 
the, they, ca they came late. They came late. They came late or not. That's not a big. They came late or not. That's not a big issue. Prabhupada giving Siddhanta Vichar. You can watch those who are coming here to fulfill the desire of Gauranga. Not according to the estimation of common people. Some argument can start. According to the estimation of Bhaktivinoda Thakur, Prabhupada, or Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Those who are coming here to implement the teachings of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Si Chaitanya Mano Bhishtam Sthapitam Yena Bhutale. That is the symptom. So he is coming before or after. Like Srila Madhavendra Puripat came much early. Papa didn't see Madhavendra Puripat physically. So then you can say useless. Is Siddhanta useless? Not that. Papa saying this is a document. Sometime some parikar, eternal parsat can come before and some of them can, 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 can after or some of them can together with Gauranga Mahapu. All Advaita Gosai, Nita, all, you know, they are actually Bhagavan, all, all other parsat. They are all coming with, together with Gauranga. They took birth, Sarup Gosai, Adi, all, Raya Ramananda, all together. In our kirtan, we are crying. Our Guru Bargo is written, Bhakti Mahaprabhu Thakur. Hoilo manusya janmo na hoilo takhon. Oh Bhagavan, why I could not take bath at the time of Gauranga Mahaprabhu? Why? If I could take bath that time, I could see the excellent lila, golden avatar. Lochandas Thakur or our Guru Bhargava all speak in this way. So coming before, coming with or coming after, that's not a big issue. Who is coming for what purpose? What reason? That is more important. That is the reason. Prabhupada came after, long after, Bhakti Muntava came after, not Muntava came, Sinivasajya came after. Sinivasajya could not see Gauranga. Gauranga, by that time, he came, but he wanted to see. That time, Mahaprabhu was there in Nalacha. By that time, disappears. Uh, actually, uh, our Godadar Pandit also disappeared. All disappeared. So, who came before, middle, uh, with, or after that? So, if you can very carefully watch, then you can see that the desire of Gauranga Mahapu, who wanted to implement, practically, wanted to implement. According to that, you can. Madhavandhu Puripad, though, came earlier. Even, what to speak about Madhavandhu Puripad, even Billamangal Thakur, even about Billamangal Thakur, our Guru Bhargava speaking, Billamangal Thakur took bath long before. Madhavandi Prabhupada took but before, but still, our Guru Bhargava Prabhupada is speaking that golden avatar already appeared inside their heart. How you know? Well, this kind of, this kind of writing, this kind of bhajan, impossible. This kind of writing, this kind of bhajan, impossible without darshan of Gauranga. Surely molten gold, this, uh, is this avatar, appeared inside long before. And according to that, they are getting, they got uh, uh, guidance. Otherwise, this kind of prema, this kind of writing, this kind of expression, not possible. Molten avatar, Gauranga. Guru Bhargava is saying, maybe they appeared long before. But anyway, Gaur avatar is eternally present. Gaurav Bhattar eternally present, na? So Gaurav Bhattar already appeared inside your heart. Maybe not physically. Maybe not in material world, they cannot see Gaurango appear. But inside heart, they saw Gaurango. 
According to that, their heart was so sophisticated because without this, this kind of writing by, this kind of writing by Billamangal Thakur, impossible. This kind of mood of Ishwar Madhavendra Puripad, impossible. And by the Kipya or Madhavendra Puripad, Ishwar Puripad also getting the same. Ishwar Puri getting the same, na? All total kipa. From Gurudev, one disciple can get total kipa. Not that partial kipa. By the mercy of Gurudev, a disciple can get 100-100%. Don't, don't think that maybe not possible, 80% or 50%, not that. Document there in Bhagavatam. In Bhagavatam, it is written that if Gurudev is satisfied, he can get a Bhagavatam glorification of Guru Preta Prajat Chati Vaikuntha Priya Darshanam. Vaikuntha Yogi Darshanam. So also it is written, Snigdasya Sishyasya, Snigdasya Sishyasya Gurubha Guiham Upi Uto. Snigdasya in Bhagavatam it is written, Snigdasya Sishyasya. Snigdasya Sishyasya Gurubha. Guiham Opi Uto. Even secrets of the secrets, we impossible to unveil. This mystery, this mysterious thing also, Gurudev is ready to unveil in front of his, in front of his Snigdo Shishya. Snigdo, literal meaning sober. Literal meaning of Snigdo is sober. But this meaning we cannot accept. We cannot accept. Sober is a material meaning. Material meaning is a literal meaning. Sober means the disciple is harmonized with the heart of Gurudev 100%. This is a sober. Like Ishar Puripad. He is a sober personage. Ishar Puripad 100% harmonized with the heart of Madhavendra Puripad. It is written there. Madhavendra Puripad, before living body, bless. You can get everything, everything in total. That's why. So, Snigdosa Sishya So Guru Bhagavad Gita, how we can? Simply by watching that he is erected or selected as the chief of the temple. By this way, you cannot understand the keeper. Simply by watching, he is selected or elected in the temple. By watching this, you cannot understand. This is not the procedure. That's why Prabhupada told, election or selection is totally obsolete. Election or selection procedure is, it is not, it is not, a, it is not an, a, a political game. Who is not elected? Who is not at all elected? He was seen, he is totally getting power. Who is selected, not getting power. Not in line. If your eyes are open, you can see. If you are blind or biasedness something, then you cannot understand. Automatically. Gurudev eternally present. Whom Gurudev going to best of full kipa? It depends upon his character, behavior, efficacy, serving mood, according to that. Election or selection, Baba speaking, is not applicable. This way, not possible. So this way, Madhavendra Puripat took bath before and it is also one direct document that why Gauranga Mahapu going to break that, the writing of Billa Mangal Thakur? Why Gauranga Mahapu going to bring that Billa Mangal Thakur book and going to get test? This is, this is a secret, secret indication. Mahaprabhu, day and night, gradually I can go on discussing, day and night, day and night, day and night, Mahaprabhu used to get the test of Karnamrito, Vidyapati, Chandidas, or Karna, uh, uh, you know, our Brahma Sangita, all. Brahma Sangita is all documentary, but Mahaprabhu brought it for us. Actually, he used to hear all the time. 
Kobi, you know, written by Billa Mangal Thakur. This is also indication that Mahaprabhu, this is also indication that he manifested his sarup in front of him and he appeared according to his kripa. He was in a position to get the taste of Krishna Leela for 850 years. Bilangal Thakur was alive 850 years. Yes. 850 years continuously at the bank of Brahma Kundu. Continuously. 850 years. At the bank of Brahma Kundu. Continues to do. And our body function according to normal habit used to do. So many such evidence. Evidence. 350 years. 350 years, one uh, Shaibo, Shaibo, he is a devotee of Siv, Siv in Varanasi. His name is Toilongo Sami. His name is Toilongo Sami. His name is Toilongo Sami. Toilongo Sami. He is Shaibo. He used to do bhajan. He used to, bhajan, I cannot say. He used to do practice of Brahma. Brahma. Brahma Dhyan. So powerful. So fat. Like, hey, yeah, like Mahadev. Kashi Baranasi, common people used to say, he is a living uh, mobile Sankar. British people, he arrest, British people arrested him. Somebody complained, somebody complained, somebody, somebody complained to police, British people, British people. That Baba has some uh, some uh, some dangerous plan and program. He is actually very, uh, you know, bad man. So, policeman coming, arrest him and put inside jail. Putting inside jail. Hello, lock and key. And next morning, policeman become mad that the Baba already outside jail, lock is there, he is moving around. Yes. Same Baba, he is not flying. He was kept inside jail. Just morning time, policeman, the jailer discovered he is outside and moving around with a hand. But outside jail. Then policeman become mad. Oh, their information was wrong. He leave it, leave it, leave it. It's Siddha Mahatma. Something can happen in my last seat. So about Siva, Saiva. He was there. So, what to speak about Billa Mangal Thakur? Billa Mangal Thakur, our Guru Bhargava giving indication that Mahaprabhu all day and night getting the test of this, you know, Karnamitra, that's when there is some clue that there is some connection with Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Connection. Externally, we cannot find long ago. Anyway, so Radharani. Following Akadushi or not, those who are putting their idiot number one. Rupa Goswami following or not, actually, when Rupa Goswami path coming, when, when Rupa Manjuri coming in the form of Rupa Goswami path, they are going to show. Because Gauranga Mahaprabhu, try to understand, Gauranga Mahaprabhu himself Bhagavan, Supreme Lord, Swayam Rupa Bhagavan, not only Bhagavan, who is Krishna, he is. But still he is going to do acharan and swaying to show us. But I cannot expect Krishna is following Akadushi or following the what for? Krishna following Akadushi or not? But Mahaprabhu requested Sochima, you should follow Akadushi. <coughs> Don't know need. Sochima need not follow Akadushi, but still to, to teach us, Mahaprabhu requesting, Mother. You should follow Akadushi, everything. So, this way. So, now Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, his all, each and every acharan, we can try to understand very slowly. Yesterday, we already discussed that Sarvam Bhattacharya is totally delivered. Mahaprabhu delivered him. Mahaprabhu already delivered him. Now his situation, his speech, his looking, all his activity now changed. 
just like a magic spell, overnight change. Like the case of, you know, that pros, you heard, and Lakshya Hira, who wanted to prove that Haridas Thakur is crack, characterless. She wanted to prove by the provocation of some influential personality, landlord, by the provocation, he, the landlord wanted to give some huge amount of money, and he, requ he requested Lakshahira, you are topmost pros in our locality, so you can go, Haridas Thakur doing bhajan, you can prove it, that Haridas Thakur is characterless, all public can come to know, and then nobody can respect him anymore. He was developing some jealousy with him. Hello. So Haridas Thakur, not paying attention. So that pros coming, consecutively one, two, three days. First day coming, going to give some indication, I like to get your association, this, that. Haridas Thakur, wait, wait, wait. My Harinam can be completed then. They association mean, Haridas Thakur not speaking lie. By association, Haridas Thakur wanted to say, fine association. My je, ideal character, behavior, my acharan, that I can give to you. My, you can get some effect of my acharan. Acharan doesn't mean, Sangha doesn't mean physical Sangha. Sangha doesn't mean always, Sangha doesn't mean always sang, physical Sangha. Fine Sangha is also there. Physical Sangha does always physical Sangha. A physical Sangha also can be, but not that always meaning this. Eh? Then why North Madhagur writing that, what is it? Uh, uh, Ki, North Mutha writing, ki, writing Kirtan. Uh, ki, uh, uh, ki Sinivas Acharya, uh, Ramchandra Sangha Mane, Ramachandra Sangha Mane, Narottama Das. Ramchandra Sangha Mane, Narottama Das. But Narottama Das, Narottama Das are praying. But Ramchandra already gone. Now, the, what do you mean by Sangha? Mental Sangha, many fine Sangha. Even today you can get the Sangha, even today, whereas Prabhupada gone long ago, even today you can get the Sangha of Bhakti Metrogan Prabhupada. Why not? Through his writing, we can get the Sangha of Bindamanda Chakur by his writing. We can get the Sangha of Krishnadas Kavira Goswami. All our previous Guru Varga, they are written there. This is called fine Sangha. Sangha doesn't mean only physical Sangha. Not. If so, then why Rupa Goswami was writing in his Upadesha Amrita? Why writing? If Sangha is physical Sangha, only it means, then how Rupa Goswami was writing? Eh? Dadati, Pratiginyati, Prichati, Guyama, Khyati, Bhongte, Bhajayate, Iti, Saravidha, Priti Lakshanam. Those are the six points, basic points on the basis of which we knowingly or unknowingly we are getting association. That's why a big question can come. Even with Mahaprasadam, even with physical association, I can go there and uh, get the association of those sadhus, yes or not. Who can guide us? or for only glamour and position, I am going to join that famous society, only because people, I can become famous. What is the reason? So, Rupa Goswami was speaking, and Bhakti Thakur all more clearly, more clearly, Bhakti Thakur writing. There is Sangha mean, Bhakti Thakur speaking, Sangha mean exchange of loveful moon, loveful moon. Suppose there is one Bandara in your temple. Suppose there is Bandara in your temple. Temple commander engage you, Martin Church. You have to distribute prasadam. You can start fighting. Why I can distribute prasadam? Because Dadati Pratikindra, I cannot do. I can get bad as wrong. Because you are ordered, 
you are ordered to distribute prasadam. You are not exchanging any loveful mood. The order you are going to carry out prasadam. But when somebody is going to give some something with loveful mood, you accept this Jagannath prasad. You take it. Jagannath was out of love. Exchange of priti. Then association. This kind of association, if you are doing with wrong man, lose character, then you are never going to make any improvement in your bhajan. So regarding your prasadam taking, regarding your exchange of love, full mood, you are going to speak something secret. What came in in dream. In your dream something came. So you are going to exchange with some so-called devotee. Then you are going to exchange priti. And if he is a fallen soul, you can also fall. Follow what he say. So, dadati, pratiginnati, you are giving something in return. You are giving me something, Maharaj, you, are, you take it, you know. You take it out of loveful mood, you bring something. I will have to accept it. I will have to accept it. If not so, big danger can happen. So I will have to accept it because Bhakti Vita Madhu Goswami Mara directly teaching to Bharati Maharaj. One time he was in Elehavad. One old lady making some halwa. Halwa, you know, halwa. He making nice halwa. And after that, going to distribute him sadhu. That old lady, very nice lady, not bad. Then he is going to give this halwa to Madhu Goswami Maharaj. I mean, I am Narottama Mamachari. So I take. Hadu. Then Narottama Brahmacharya Bharati Maharaj not like to take it. Don't like to take. But Madhu Goswami was speaking, you take it. You take it, accept it. You accept it. Maybe you cannot eat, you can give to somebody. But now, he, because if you are not going, if you are going to reject that old lady like your mother, she can break your heart. So it is not good. It is not good. Very careful, Acharan. Our Bhaman Goswami Maharaj, when he used to go, now AC, DC, so plain, everything. By that time, we used to travel in local train. Bhakti Mithagur, Bhopad, my Gurudev, Kasev, so all local train. I also, until recently, all local train. <laughs> so, suppose our Bhaman Goswami Maharaj going to Vrindavan, Mathura. So, in a train, he is sitting. He said, no special ticket, nothing. They are all big, big acharya. Suppose, who is sitting just near to you, next seat, who is going to open his food, all meat, garlic, everything, oh! Practically, I also experience. I am up, so much. I cannot speak anything. I cannot speak anything. I have to suffer. Then Bhavan Goswami normally sitting. They are eating meat, they are eating fish, all they are making dirty, all everything. They no, no acharan. Garlic, bad smell. But still he is with full patience, sitting, as if nothing happened. Then the Sebak speaking, Maharaj, how you are sitting here? Bhavan was speaking, you see, if I am going to express some, uh, uh, some reaction, then they can also, if I am going to express some reaction, then by watching my reaction, they can feel, hey, sadhu, hey, we are eating, you are. Then they can develop some disrespect and they can fall down. They are already in fallen condition. They are already in fallen condition, but they can more so, they can pull more down. So better I cannot feel, uh, I cannot show any reaction. So that they can at least feel, we are taking our rice, chapati, meat, fish, whatever, normal. If I feel, so, if I show some reaction, they can become angry with me. Is sadhu? Is sadhu? Is going to reaction? We are eating, he is going to hit? Then big problem will arise. So, dadati, pratiginyati, prichati, guhyamakshati, prichati, eh? bhungte bhayati, six. You are going to give something to eat, prasadam you make, eating, and somebody giving to you, you are also, bhungte bhajati. All other. So, in a function, you are ordered to distribute prasadam. 
you are going to carry out your order, you are distributing prasadam. They are surely or not going to exchange some priti. So, exchange of priti is big. So, that is why, that is why our Guru Bhargava, even Mahaprabhu, wanted to show priti, wanted to exchange priti. What our Kapil Muni told to Devavati Mana, same thing, Sangoja Sangsitir Hetuhu, Asasu Vihito Dhiya, Shoyevo Sadhusu Kritaha, eh? Sadhusu Kritaha, Nishanga Taya Kalpate, original so. But sometimes I say, eh? Uh, actually, I am just one one sloka, from two sloka, one one line. Hello. Nishanga Taya Kalpate, originally. Nishanga Taya Kalpate, mane? Material quality, Sataraja Tamagun. Somebody having is going to exchange you, then you are going to contaminate it. That's why Kopilji is seeking, Mother, you will have to exchange this kind of pretty, loveful exchange with sadhus. You are going to make some like, without loveful exchange, nobody can live in this society. Without loveful exchange, can you live? You will have to give. It's a must. But how to do? Very tactfully. If you are going to do a full exchange with any material man, then you are going to feel some reaction. At the same priti, you are going to show with some Sadhguru Vaishnava, because they are in transcendental realm, they are not in this material world, their quality is not material quality, so you can get bonus, bonus mark, you know, bonus mark. If you, suppose you exchange with some Sadhguru, by chance, he gives Maharaj, you can eat, you can take, you know. He exchange, that he is going to accept it. When he is going to take even one, one thing, what you are offering, then you can get benefit. That is exchange of love, love for love. So in this, in this material world, nobody can live without loveful exchange. Even tiger, who is a ferocious, going to loveful exchange with the baby. Tiger baby? Going to kiss, give milk. So, exchange of love is a march. Haridas Thakur wanted to mean this, but that pros wanted to think that physically he can get my sangha. But Haridas Thakur wanted to exchange some laughful, okay, okay, I can fulfill that. So, he is hearing continuously Harinam, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, continuous hearing. So, when Haridas Thakur pronouncing Harinam, then that pros, she have the privilege to hear. So he says, anyway, anyway she is waiting there. What is that going to be wet? I can, after my Harinam is over, I can uh, do your Sangha, give you my Sangha. <laughs> I can give you my Sangha after Harinam. But Harinam is not complete. The pros become angry. What to do? I am taking resolution every day. Now today by chance my Harinam is not complete. So I could not uh, uh, give my association to you. I can associate. So next day, again next day coming. Next day also same thing. Pros become angry because the morning time sun going to rise. If run away, something uh, problem can happen. Third day, consecutively, consecutively for three days, continuously hear, hearing the Harinam by the great. Gauru Parsat Harida, the, then heart automatically changed. Heart of that pros already changed. He confessed, I came here to prove that you are loose character. I was given offer by one rich man, is paying money to me. Harida is smiling. Harida I already knew it before. But I am not going away. I am not going away from this place to deliver you. Oh, really? Yes. I wanted to give me, I wanted to, I wanted to give you my association. I wanted to give you my association. You wanted to give my association. Na? Same thing, Prabhupada speaking. When Gaurkishwad Das Bhaji Maharaj speaking, don't do the association of any Prabhupada said, I am not doing association of anybody. I am giving, I am not doing association. I actually Prabhupada, Prabhupada used to meet with material man, na? 
Preaching means material man can come. Preaching means material people can come for inquiry. Na? So, Prabhupada never wanted to get their association. Rather, Prabhupada used to give his own association. Rather, Prabhupada, his big personality, Prabhupada used to give his own association to them to deliver. This is the technique. While you are going in preaching, there is so much glamour, position in foreign country. How much European country? If you are hypnotized, then okay. Or if your preaching is over, <laughs> they can preach in front of you. Your preaching is over. They can preach in front of you, you take money, 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 a position, is that they can. That, that means they are preaching in front of you. You are not preaching in front of them. Preaching means you will have to give, inculcate all, everything, what, what good qualities, what you have. So, hello, reconciliation is not at all allowed. I can discuss tomorrow. Reconciliation is not allowed in the way of devotion. Not at all, at any cost. But if you have your power, you can give some association to them. Like Prabhupada used to invite so big, 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 big district magistrate or eh, DIG, all big, big, high court judge, to give them their association. One such thing happened. You think it is one kind of philosophy, but I can directly can show you an example. In Calcutta, in Calcutta, for seven days, continuously, Harikatha, Kirtan going on. Madhagusya Maharaj. Madhagusya, Si Chaitanya Gauri on. Madhagusya Maharaj sitting, Sridhar Goswami Maharaj, Bhakti Mahat Puri Goswami Maharaj, Jajabar Goswami Maharaj, Bhaktar, all devotees, like star, Kesab Maharaj, all sitting. Follow. And there, High Court Judge, Big honor. He is coming and sitting. He was invited. After that, he is sitting. After that, all Guru Bargo speaking Harikatha. And he was also allowed, he was also allowed to speak something, whatever he knows. Actually, Prabhupada invited them so that they can accept Gauranga. They can understand. That is the secret move. Not to give them honor unnecessarily. In this pretext, they can get some favor of a public can come also. He is coming. But after the assembly is over, before the assembly, after the assembly is over, kitan, final kitan. After the assembly is over, now finally kitan. Kitan actually Jajavar Gosema. Bhakti Bisha Jajavar Gosema, he was allowed to do kitan. And he started kitan. And the district. I am in that, uh, that you know, High Court judge. He, he is uh, taking permission for Maharaj. Maharaj, could you please excuse me? I, I, I have some appointment, I have to go. Uh, Maharaj, okay, you are busy. Then the security guard, they are going to take him. He is going to go away and going to sit inside his car. He was just going to sit inside his car to go away. In the meantime, while he is leaving his chair, seat, own seat where he was sitting in the assembly, after that going on, in the meantime, he hear the absolute kirtan of Jajavar Goswami Maharaj. Miracle happened. He already gone and see, he already was inside car. Again, his big diver is stop, open the car, again coming and sitting in the same chair. Miracle. He gone already. So busy, very busy. But again he come back and sit in the same chair as well. Madhav Goswami has turned. After the kitten is over, that High Court just speaking, I invite you all in my own house in Salt Lake you can't pass. Especially this kitten when I hear, I feel some reaction inside my heart. By hearing this kirtan of this Maharaj, I feel some reaction inside heart. That's why I, I am bound to come like a magnet and sit till the kirtan is finished. So don't think all rubbish, don't think all false. The same teaching Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wanted to give us all the time. 
every exchange of lawful affair. Be it with Sarvamartya Chajyo, with Sarvamartya Chajyo, Mahaprabhu embraced him. Mahaprabhu embraced already Jagai Madhai, notorious Gunda, notorious Gunda, Jagai Madhai. Mahaprabhu embraced him, them. And after that, by this loveful exchange, their heart was totally changed. By hearing Kirtan, with Jagai Madhai, Mahaprabhu started dancing. Document is there. After delivering Gorni, after delivering Jagai Madhai, Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu was dancing with them, singing with them. So much. So, each and every time, we can see that Mahaprabhu going to deliver devotees, be it beasts or birds, anything. So, Lakshmi, Laksh, Lakshahida, he was changed within three days, continuously by hearing the Harinam. He was changed, not only changed, he was, he was a jewel. She was a jewel. Not only it is written in Chaitanya Bhagavad, the Haridas Thakur is a jewel, touch stone. Haridas Thakur can convert iron into gold. But here in this case, Haridas Thakur is a jewel. He was bound to make that, you know, that pros jewel, another jewel. And it is written, all hundreds of Acharya, big, big, they are coming to take darshan of that Mataji. It is written. That all big, big acharyas, they are coming to take darshan of the lotus feet of that pros. So how possible? Boro boro acharyo, they are coming to take darshan of that. Because he received kipa from Haridas Thakur. Now you cannot, now you have no right to, now you have no right to insult her. Jagai Madai Mahaprabhu speaking, now you have no right to insult them. Now you have no right to point out that previously they were hooligan, gunda, whatever wrong, drinking wine. No more you can speak. You have no right. Now I do keep up. They already changed. They are devotee. Nobody should point out their previous activities. Mahaprabhu giving warning. Nobody should point out their previous activities. Now they have taken new birth. They have taken new birth. No worries. This way. So Mahaprabhu, after delivering uh, whom? Sarvamata Jijo embraced him. By embracing, going to give love, prema. Sarvamata Jijo was totally converted. Totally. He cannot remember who he was before. He cannot believe himself. His heart melt, shedding tears, always sitting and, and watching the molten gold, that avatar, Sarva Bhattacharya. He cannot speak anything. And Sarva Bhattacharya wrote a hundred sloka, I already told, like wind. And some slok, some, some slok, out of, he wrote hundred, out of that some sloka, Gauriya Vaishnavas, they memorize. They memorize and they speak in front of public. So, Sarvamata Jaju was delivered. Now, we already told Mahaprabhu getting accommodation inside Gambira Mandir. Some devotees suggested the room some devotees suggested the room of, uh, some uh, suggested the building of uh, Kasi Mishra. Then, when this information came to Kasi Mishra, Mahapu went there, <coughs> Mahapu said, Could you please arrange? But what you are speaking? All yours. All yours, my body, building, whatever, all your, whatever you like, you can take. It's very sad. I am very sad that you are asking permission from me. From then onward, Mahaprabhu started staying there because that place is very nice place, nice in the sense Mahaprabhu daily going to uh, ocean to take bath, 
Every day, Mahaprabhu going to take bath in ocean. At the same time, Mahaprabhu all the time going to Jagannath Mandir. So it is just halfway, halfway. When I for Kasimisya Bhavan, if, I, if you go to Jagannath Mandir, it is halfway. And if you go to ocean to take bath, halfway. And also Chatak Parvat is nearby. At the same time, Haridas Chakur crying. Haridas, actually, Haridas Chakur was taken. For the first time, when Mahaprabhu, after taking sannyas, when going to Nilachal Dham, that time Haridas Thakur was there and Nityananda Prabhu was there, all there. Follow that time. So Haridas Thakur crying, where I can stay without you, I can die. Mahaprabhu said, I can take you to Nilachal Dham. I can take you, no problem. Then after that, reaching Nilachal, all incident I already told. Mahaprabhu going inside Jagannath temple to embrace this way, how he uh, gone uh, unconscious condition, how he was taken, after all, everything over. Now, actually, Mahaprabhu getting accommodation in Gambiramandi, special place, special place. And Haridas Thakur, Haridas Thakur was given, Haridas Thakur was given a place. Haridas Thakur also was given a place just near. At present, so many temple, uh, at present, so many building and everything. So, you will have to come out of Kasi Mishra Bhagam, you will have to take trouble to enter into land and go. But previously, if you can imagine, there was no building. So, here Haridas, here Mahaprabhu staying, Haridas Thakur just there. Now you are going through land and then that's why long distance. But previously there was no building. I myself, when I took, Guru Maharaj uh, allowed me to take white wares, that time, whole night I was there in the temple, to, uh, I mean, uh, building top, and Guru Maharaj was there. So, Jagannath Mandir was clearly visible. Now at present you can see, so big, big building. Jagannath Mandir, Jagannath wheel, all you can see very clearly. Ocean, now all building, hostel, oh, finished. So, Haridas Thakur was given a nice place there in, nearby. Nearby was given a place, what we call Haridas Thakur Bhajan Kutir, or at present is famous as Siddha Bakul. At present it is famous as Siddha Bakul. Bakul is one kind of tree. The long history. That bakul tree is not going to die. Bakul tree, that one tree, bakul tree. And still today, that stick of that bakul tree going for Jagannath to Jagannath every day morning. Pujari offering water for washing face and uh, for brushing that bakul tree. Still today. So, this is strange, actually. So, Haridas Thakur was given place there, and it was the rules. Mahaprabhu used to go to Jagannath Mandir daily, all the time, doing sankirtan and everything. And Mahaprabhu, it was the, it was the, it was the general rule. It was the general rule. Every day, Mahaprabhu used to go morning time to take darshan of Jagannath. And while coming back, Panda, usually they are giving some mala, prasadam, probably you take, he used to take in his cloth and coming fast to Haridas Chakur. Haridas, I got this prasadam for you, you take it. How lucky Haridas. Jag he is not going to Jagannath temple. Jagannath coming, Jagannath himself coming to give darshan. You see the luck. Mahaprabhu is Jagannath. But anyway, he is not allowed, he is not going. He said, I am Muslim, I took birth in a Muslim family. But you see the technique of Mahaprabhu. When, I can give an example, when Haridas Chakur came, when Haridas Chakur came with, with Mahaprabhu, actually, then Mahaprabhu calling all devotees. Mahaprabhu calling all devotees. They are coming one by one, embracing. Mahaprabhu calling Haridas Chakur. Hey, where is Haridas? You call, call, I, Mahaprabhu. Uh, where is Haridas? 
Uh, Haridas is lying down in the main road. Haridas lying down in the main road where people are going and coming. And prostrate Dandavat, devotee is running and coming. Haridas, Prabhu, call you. Immediately you can go. I have no power to go. I have no power to go because I have taken birth in a low family, Muslim family. So you please request Prabhu, I can take prasadam outside gate. Hello. Point is that Mahaprabhu could, Mahaprabhu could easily bring him, could easily. But Mahaprabhu not applying pressure. Mahaprabhu wanted to keep the balance between dignity of devotees and also that Mahaprabhu, he wanted to establish Varnasam Dharma. So, externally, to maintain the external work, internally Haridas Thakur, internally Haridas Thakur sitting inside the heart of Mahaprabhu or Mahaprabhu sitting inside the heart of Haridas. But externally, you see the very fine darshan. Actually, Haridas Thakur, his space, place is there inside the heart of Gauranga. But still physically, no, what happens? You come inside temple, not speaking. Why? He is going to make the balance. So that outside people, those are ignorant, they can think, I am going to break all rules and everything. So Haridas Thakur is sitting inside the heart of Mahaprabhu. And Mahaprabhu is sitting inside the heart of, Mahaprabhu is sitting inside the heart of, Haridas But externally, he is not going to break the dignity. Like Rup Sanatan. Mahaprabhu could easily, forcefully, Mahaprabhu could take them inside Jagannath temple. Why not? Why not? They take birth. They took birth in a very high family. Brahman category. Some Brahman category there. Not all Brahmans same. Brahman category. So this Rup Sanatan, they are from the topmost category of Brahman, Bharat Raj Gotriyo. So, why they are not going inside temple? Mahaprabhu is not going to put, hey, you have to go with me to temple, not speaking. Rather, Mahaprabhu wanted to set, rather, Mahaprabhu wanted to set some example by their character. You see, Haridas in Namacharya. Namacharya means nothing more than name of Bhagavan. Namacharya means he is the Acharya of Harinam. Namacharya means he is the Acharya of Harinam, elected by Mahaprabhu. So his dignity, his position is topmost. Yes or not? He is the Nam Acharya. Nam is the top. Na? Nam is topmost. So Mahaprabhu is going to confirm he is the topmost. But still Mahaprabhu is not going to apply force on you. You break all, you come. Our Sonatan Rup, when they are going to Nilachaldam, not. Mahaprabhu not speaking, hey, you have to go with me to Jagannath temple. Rather, Mahaprabhu, it was Mahaprabhu, very nice teaching. Mahaprabhu wanted to teach us that you see Rup Sanatan, they didn't think it necessary to go inside temple because they, they used to do service with the king, Muslim king. Muslim king, na? Rup Sanatan was under, under mean, they used to do service of king, Muslim king, Hussein Shah. Sanatan Goswami Pad was the, uh, was the prime minister of Bengal and Rupa Goswami Pad was the finance minister, finance minister. That is why they are lamenting whole life we are getting the association of Muslim king, so we are contaminated. So we have no right to go inside our body, our mind, our, our smell. When we are going to exhalation, our air can go and contaminate the situation. So I cannot go. So have you seen Mahaprabhu putting pressure? Hey, you will have to go inside him. Rather, Mahaprabhu wanted to set some example by the Behavior, acharan of Rupsana. Do you think Rupsanathan is a fallen soul? <laughs> How possible? Same joking Mahaprabhu used to do with Ballav Acharya. Mahaprabhu knowing he has some false ego, I am from high family. When Ballav Acharya is going to uh, 
it is not the case of Nilachal. By chance I speak. When Mahaprabhu was then there in uh, Triveni Shangam, Triveni, Triveni, Elhavad, then Mahaprabhu was taken to the house of Balava Sharyu, Arail Gram, the name of the village Arail. There, Balava Sharyu, by watching the Watching Mahaprabhu, he is feeling something great. He took Mahaprabhu by boat. And that time, our Anupam and uh, Rupa Goswami Pad was there. He went there. The Rupa, Rupa Goswami Pad was there. And Pallava Charjo want to give garland. And then Rupa Goswami Pad running back. Running back. No, 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 no. Don't, they don't touch me. Don't touch me. I am fallen. Then Mahaprabhu joking. They are fallen actually. <laughs> Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu joking. Actually, they are fallen. You are so high. That's why you should not touch them. Balavacharya manipulating, thinking, must be some game here. <laughs> Mahaprabhu thinking, some game must be there. They can never be a fallen. Because they continue speaking Harinam, Hare Krishna. So how they are fallen? Mahaprabhu joking. So Mahaprabhu used to joke this way. So, Mahaprabhu always wanted to set some example by the help of which we can cut our false ego. False ego, false ego is the main impediment. Our false ego is the main impediment in our life. Whole, everybody. False ego is the main. That's why we cannot make any progress in Harivaj. False ego is going to make us fall down. Even I can give example when Mahaprabhu went to Mathura, there also Sonoriya Brahman. Sonoriya Brahman. So what is the teaching of Mahaprabhu? In Sonoriya Brahman, they meet with each other. In Keshav Mandir, Adi Keshav, they realize every other, oh, so nice devotee. And Mahaprabhu asking, I think by watching your reaction, everything, I think you have some link with some, uh, our Gauriya Guru, yes. I am the disciple of Madhavindu. Yeah, you are my guru. When Mahaprabhu is going to catch his leg. Oh, don't touch. You are Bhagavan. No, I am not Bhagavan. So, Madhavindu Puripat, Madhavindu Puripat, Madhavindu Puripat went there. Madhavindu Puripat previously, long ago, went there. And he took prasadam, roti, chapati, there. So, Mahaprabhu speaking, uh, I can give, I can take prasadam. You cannot take prasadam in my house because we are low grade, we are low grade Brahman, very low grade. If you take prasadam in our, our, our house, all people can criticize you, criticize you. Mahaprabhu began, what did concern to me? What did concern to me? Whereas my previous Guru Varga, Madhavindu Puribhat too, Mahayano Jeno Gato Sapantya, Mahayano, Yenoga, ah, Madhavindu Puripat took prasadam. Who am I? Mahaprabhu speaking. Who am I? Mahaprabhu. Madhavindu Puripat took prasadam. My previous guru, I can also take. Let people criticize. So you try to understand the teachings of Mahaprabhu. Very secret teaching. Externally, he is going to maintain everything. Even in Varanasi, when Mahaprabhu went, he used to take prasadam in Kasimisra Bhavan. He used to stay in Chandrasekarachet Bhavan. That is also balancing. Chandrasekhar is Sudra. Chandrasekhar is low caste. So Mahaprabhu want to, wanted to give Kipa by staying there and used to take prasadam in, in Kasi. Uh, there his name was, what is his name? Uh, Tapan Misro. Sorry, I remember. Tapan Misro. And his son is our, uh, uh, what is called? Tap Raghunath Bhatto. Raghunath Bhatto, he is the son of Tapan Misro. Raghunath Das, Raghunath Bhatto is the son of that Tapan Misro. So Mahaprabhu is how balancing? So that external world cannot see anything, criticize and they can fall down. So Mahaprabhu hundred times can take prasadam in the house of Chandrasekhar Rajajwa. He is not going to hate. Devotees also understand. Prabhu want to make so that the all mismanagement, all society can break down. So externally he is going to manage in such a way, he is taking prasadam in the house of 
Chandrasekhar Raja, uh, actually, how uh, Tapan Miso and going to take a uh, rest there. This way, always Mahaprabhu wanted to make balance, not that he used to hate. Haridas Thakur was given the topmost honor among all group. I can come to the discussion, Haridas Thakur and Sanatan discussing. Who is speaking what? On Nilachal Lila, we can. Anyway, today I'm bound to stop here. So, what is. What I saw, the word sloka I started with. Sabhakti Vasudhyam Nija Bhajana Mudram Padishan Sri Chaitanya King Me Punarapi Deswar Yaswati Padam Vanchakal Padrushi Kipasin Padidanan Padrushi Kipasin Padidanan Padrushi What Jagadananda told to learn the teaching of Mahaprabhu. What Jagadananda I can discuss tomorrow. Jagadamura told us very easy, very easy to accept the teachings, but it is very hard for us. How? 